guys so this is another video of my hauls so this one is kind of like a weekend haul video i didn't buy enough from the same shop to kind of do separate ones on this one so i thought i would just put these all together just to make it a lot easier so i'm just going to pick bits off of the table that i've put in front of me and i'm gonna go from there so first of all one of the stores that i go to quite a lot and that's CEX. So I picked two things up from CEX this time. So I picked up Elemental Gelade Collection. So this is the full series. There's one series of this um, anime and I absolutely adore it. If you've never watched this, it's so good. Um, this character is called Ku and he is a kind of sky pirate-esque. Um, he's your typical young boy coming of age and he's the typical clumsy falls in love with everything kind of boy but it's a very very lovely story um elementals which are like this character here have kind of what they call like gems on their bodies they can be on their heads their backs their necks anywhere really and it gives them powers um they are completely naturally made and they can connect with different people for instance they choose to connect with people or equivalently are forced to and they basically have to they will either work together or get forced to work with people and stuff like that but yes so this cost me 18 pounds fully happy to pay that price i'm gonna make the boyfriend sit down and watch the whole of this because i absolutely adore this whole series so definitely a good one if you haven't seen this one so the second thing that I got was actually the second most expensive thing that I bought the whole weekend and it is Daigri, I can't pronounce it very well, but it's this, this is yeah, Daigria 5 I'm going with, um, this is on the Nintendo Switch, it cost me £42, it's really 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 good, I really highly recommend this, this is one of the ones I really wanted but unfortunately, due to a lot of stuff going on with Nintendo at the time, they were just like screwing me about. I never got this because I had the limited edition pre-ordered. I didn't have my Switch because they were mucking me about. And then I was a bit like, do you know what? Fine, I'm going to cancel it because what's the point in having the game that I want when I don't have the console? It's just sitting there kind of teasing me. Now you can't get that limited edition. The limited edition is like 150 blooming quid on eBay. I checked. But to pick this, the actual game up 42 is really, really good. I have been playing this quite a lot, so definitely love this game. But yeah, I would really highly recommend it. Um, it is kind of like an RPG. Um, you've also got your shops, you've got different places to go. The characters are amazing and cute. They have like bunny ears and there's like talking penguins that just say dude. It's, it's awesome. Like definitely go and check this out if you haven't checked it out already. So, the next shop that I went in was HMV. Sorry, something just gone from the screen. Was HMV. So, in regards to HMV, I bought two things. So, the first thing I bought was this. Just a cute little vest top. Um, it does look really small, but it is a small, but it fits kind of perfectly. I've checked that. But yeah, so this is the Mouse 5. I absolutely love it. It's really cute, just like a little vest top. And these, um, at the moment, HMV are trying to get rid of a lot of their random stuff. So their random tops that they've just got loads of in storage. So that cost me a pound. And there was absolutely loads of tops there. Unfortunately, in it, like in any sale, they are ridiculously all smalls. But I said that small was fine. Some of the other smalls look like children's tops. So but that one was fine. And uh, the next thing that I picked up was this. So this is Blood Dash C. I haven't seen any of this. I saw a couple of trailers for this on YouTube myself. So then I thought, actually this looks like one that I'd kind of like to watch. This one, I have to admit, is set up, or what I've heard anyway, is one of the most violent ones out there. And it has some of the most glorious and brutal deaths in it as well. But yeah, it's definitely, this has got 12 episodes. 
two discs. It's only 15 apparently, but apparently some of the deaths in it are very, very brutal. So we'll give it a go and I will let you know what I think of this one. For 9 99 it's not too bad to be fair. Normally anime series can be like, there's a couple that I really want and they're like 50 quid and I'm just like, nope. I'm not gonna buy them for 50 quid, I'm trying to be good. And then I try and watch them on like online and stuff. So the next things that I got, which are super awesome, are from the Disney store. So the Disney store as well has a sale on too. So the first things I picked up was these. These are vinyl motions or vinyl motions. Can't really tell what that says because it's squiggly writing. These were 20 pounds and I got them for 349. So this is what they look like. So it's a Mickey and Minnie, it's 30th anniversary. And you can see what they look like on the back. There they come in this awesome box as well. So there's no refunds, exchanges or returns on this product, but it's absolutely adorable and I think they're super cute. And when I made these can totally come out and these can sit somewhere really awesome and cute. I think they'll love it, so that's great. The next thing that I actually got from the Disney store was this. So this is so cute, I absolutely adore it. So this cost me nine pounds and nine pence, I believe. So it was originally 12 99 But yeah, so it's got Mickey obviously doing all these funny kind of animations around. And inside, in case you can't see, so I don't think you're gonna be able to see if I just take that off. And this off. It has one of these. So these are one of the ones where you infuse the water so you can put um strawberries in it you can put lemon lime whatever you want or even just ice to be honest and then what you do is put it in the fridge then get it back in the right place there we go or you just put it in the fridge and then it infuses i thought this was much better for me and my boyfriend because what we can do then is um i can infuse, infuse some water and then we've both got some and it's nice and cool and it's already ready so but yeah i absolutely love the way this looks it's so pretty so i love that so the next shop that i went in was wh smiths now i would have bought these from waterstones but unfortunately for some untold reason waterstones i asked one of the some one of the people that work in waterstones and they have said to me that for some reason they're struggling to get these so i don't know why but i've really wanted these three books for about a couple of months now since they came out and um, yeah, so I wanted these and I managed to find them this weekend, which is really good. So this is, these three books are Disney. They weren't in the Disney store either, I did look. But yes, so this is A Whole New World, A Twisted Tale. What if Aladdin never found the lamp? So these are made by Disney and these are alternative stories. There are three of them at the moment in the series. Um, and it's just like what ifs and then you get to find out obviously by reading what if so this one is obviously aladdin this one was 6.99 then you have as old as time a twisted tale what if Belle's mother cursed the beast this one was the only one in buy one get one half price which kind of sucked but never mind so this one was 7.99 and then this one is Once Upon a Dream, A Twisted Tale. What if Sleeping Beauty never woke up? So again, this one cost me $7.99. But as I've said, I really wanted these for about a couple of months now since they came out. And I finally found all three. So I just grabbed all three so I can read one and then go straight on to the next one. So yeah, wicked. So the next thing I got this weekend, I see there, was from... Anne Summers, oh, there we go, from Anne Summers. Um, so this is a bikini. If I can undo it. Because they put some tape on it. There we go. Is a bikini. Just because I struggle when it comes to bikinis to get one that fits and holds everything. Um, I just can't go to normal retail stores and get one, unfortunately. Otherwise we would because it would be a lot cheaper. But these were on offer. I believe the bottoms had 50% off and the top had 30% off. So that's always good. I'm trying to work out what way this actually bloody goes. It goes like this. So this is the bikini. Um, 
Okay, so it does have bits that go like that. So it's got the bits that go above and kind of round your neck. Um, it's got these metal bits on it as well. It is completely adjustable, kind of like a bra, which is good. It also has padding inside, which I really like. And if you've normally got bigger boobs, you do like and prefer. And it's also got metal, like it's completely boned as well, which is really good and really helps. So this is a 38 double D. Um, you can obviously take the padding out if you choose to. But yeah, so this is really nice. So I got a set of this, so I got that one. And I also got the bottoms to go with it, which have the matching bit. So these are kind of high-waisted bottoms, but I kind of wanted that. So yeah, it's got like the metal bit and the same coloured material. So these had 50% off and the other bit had 30% off. But that is perfect. So I'm going to put that receipt back in there as well, just in case. So the next thing that I got was actually given to me by my boyfriend. So I have scribbled out his address. Um, but yeah, so this is another bikini because where it's because where we're going away and we kind of want to get just bits together because it's kind of difficult to find bikinis for me. So it's kind of like. If you can find one, you just grab it. So this is from Bravissimo, I think that says, but I'll show you what that is. So again, this is, this is a 36E. So this, I'm just gonna do the back up here, just where I tried it on, to make sure it fits. So again, so this is the bikini. It's kind of got this really pretty pattern. If I kind of do that, you can kind of see. So I love, it's kind of really pretty, I really like it. It's kind of got a little tie in the middle, which you can see there. So again, it is completely boned. It's got obviously the metal to hold you up all the way around, which I prefer. This one is just a straight strap. It doesn't have any additional bits, but that's what it looks like. Also, we got the matching bottoms to go with this one. These aren't high-waisted. These are just plain bottoms, and they are exactly the same pattern. If, you can, if I do that in the light, you can see. And they tie up at the sides, so you can get kind of sometimes away with different sizes because you can like change it if you want it tighter or looser. And also, they actually put a little bag in there too. It's like a clear bag with a zip lock on it. Um, it basically says if it's too wet to carry, so you can put it in this little cute bag, which is awesome, and we weren't expecting that, and they are quite expensive, so, but very well recommended. So, the last shop I went to was Game. So, first of all, I bought myself this. This cost me £80. So, the most expensive item of the actual weekend, which was this. So if you want to see an unboxing of this, I will link it above. I have already done an unboxing of this and completely got the figure out. I will be finding a place for Mr. Rabbit to, or Mario Rabbit, sorry, to sit. This is Mario plus Rabbids Kingdom Battle Collector's Edition. Pick up, sorry. They do do loads of other figures. This one's got all the game in it and the actual bits and bobs that you need to play the game. They do the figures separately though, and you can get, obviously in rabbit form or rabbit form, you can get Mario, Yoshi, Luigi and Peach. I actually really like the Mario, the Peach and the Yoshi most of all. Um, but they are £40 on their own. So I'm a bit, maybe I will get them all but not all in one go. So yes, yeah, so if you want to see this unboxing, I said I will link it above and at the end. So I got that. So the next thing I managed to get was three of these. So these are Disney Infinity Globe kind of holders and what you can do is it kind of, it holds one figure and one um, power disc pretty much, but they're kind of cool, they look like little bits like snow globes. These are 4 99 down from £10 and as I said I managed to get three of them. I'm trying to get all of these, all my characters in these. So if I can pick them up cheap off of eBay, off of 
Amazon, Gumtree, or even just going in stores and finding the last ones they've got reduced. I got some for a quid a little while ago from another, from Game and Basing Stoke. These came from the store in Reading, which was awesome. So, yes, it's great. Um, let me know what you think of my whole video for the weekend. I kind of bought a lot this weekend. I got paid as well, it was pay weekend. But there was a few bits that I've been looking for and I just had to pick up. And then there was a few bits that were on sale and the bikinis I needed for when we got away kind of next month. But yeah, so let me know what you think. Don't forget to leave a like on this video if you enjoyed this video. Also, don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this one. But also leaving any comments down below because I strive to answer every comment. It may take me up to about a week just because where I fit it in with my normal job too. But I will always reply to you. Thanks very much for watching though. And I will see you guys next time. So, 